We've been tracking breaking news from Pleasant Hill. Yeah, 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake is live at the intermediate school where a student threatened to bring a gun. So you just talked to a school leader. What did they have to say, Sarah? Mm hmm. Yep, that's right. Well, school's about to start here in about an hour and a half, and uh, we just talked to the assistant superintendent here. She came up here and talked to us, um, saying that they've been up practically all night investigating this. They just heard about the threat uh, in the evening time, and they posted on their Facebook page about 2.30 in the morning, alerting parents that there was a gun threat made. About 300 fifth and sixth graders go here at the intermediate school. Parents alerted the administration that their kids were saying that they they heard in school another student was going around telling all the other students that they were going to bring a gun to school today. The administration immediately took action, calling the police and the Cass County, the Cass County Juvenile Office. Pleasant Hill doesn't usually have a lot of trouble, and these students are so young. Like I said, they're fifth and sixth graders, so it was a little bit alarming that they would have a threat um, and a gun threat, no less. But the administration, the officials, they want to alert parents that it is safe and it's okay to bring their kids to school today because they are taking care of the situation. You know, I think that in the day and age we live in, that unfortunately you have to take everything seriously, whether they're fifth or sixth grader or a senior in high school. And that student who made the threat, the student will not be at school today. Today is field day, so once school starts, all the kids will be out here in this field behind me. And the assistant superintendent, Becky Gallagher, she told me they just want the students to have as normal of a day as they possibly can. We're live in Pleasant Hill. I'm Sarah Plate, 41 Action News.